Welcome to my channel. As you can probably notice, some of you, there's a new coffee machine in the intro. A little bit of a different background. We're actually visiting family right now, and we stayed longer than we originally thought. And I had footage already edited in my YouTube studio to go live for two of the days, but I don't have anything for today. So I thought, let me do like a skincare video. Of what I do when I'm on the road, because I know in the are in the car the air like circulates i have really dry skin so for me i have to be a little bit particular about it because it can easily kind of like freak out on me i don't know if anybody else is like that it's honestly nothing crazy i just thought i would do like a chatty skincare type video whatever but anyway i got this sherpa yesterday and i actually went to walmart two days ago and i saw the sherpa it's from the men's section i'll show you guys in a little bit and i could not stop thinking about it so i was like okay we gotta go back i have to buy it and it's on sale for 14 bucks. Super affordable, I'm showing you. I don't know, I just thought it was so cute. This is from the men's section. And this is a size small. I could have totally gotten a size medium. I actually wanted a size medium. I don't know why. Um, but they didn't have a size medium, so I got a size small. And it's only $14. It's not like the best quality in terms of. It's super, super cozy because it has kind of like this kind of interior. But I just thought it looked and it feels a little bit cozy, so it's like $14. I'll get it. Let me like set up. I don't even know how to set up this camera. I'm actually using, oh, I'm also actually using the iPhone. And the iPhone has like a cinematic option where it blurs the background, which is kind of cool. Is that good? Are we good? And you can see everything. You can see the Botox that I'm not keeping up with. You can see my pores. You see it all. Let me actually dampen my skin a little bit because I want my skin to be damp. Um, so that my skincare can absorb. I'm not, so I'm not applying hyaluronic acid and serums and all that onto dry skin. So I'm actually gonna dampen my skin a little bit because by the time I got this all set up, it already dried out. I did wash my face this morning already. So I do this every morning lately because I do have drier skin. I wash it just with water and it's usually fine. In the evenings, I do do my double cleanse. I actually have my Alemis with me here. So I do my double cleanse in the evenings with like a regular face wash after that and a water-based one. But in the mornings, it's for me, it's just water. So I'm just dampening it a little bit. Okay. It's just like slightly damp, nothing too wet. But I do have my serums trio that I have been loving at home. They're from Maylove. So there's hyaluronic acid. There's the vitamin C serum, their antioxidant serum, which is a great dupe for CE Ferulic. It has the same consistency, the same smell. A really great affordable option if you love the CE Ferulic. It has vitamin C, vitamin E, the way that they formulated it. Love that one. And then last one is niacinamide. Um, but when I'm traveling, I don't know much about this one, but I love Naturium as a brand. I have heard like mixed reviews when it comes to mixing all of these ingredients. My skin, you know, does fine with it, but I'm sure Susan Yara, she owns the brand. I'm sure she has formulators who kind of know what they're doing, but when I really want to be kind of serious about my serums, I'll kind of use them individually. I like the Ordinary, May Love, um, Natrium does have like individual ones. I got this one because I thought it'd be great to like knock all of them out at once, but now I'm not sure about it, so. But this is just what I took to travel instead of taking all these different serums with me so i'm gonna put that on and then i go in right away with a moisturizer this one's from naturium also it's just like a light great everyday moisturizer honestly and i'll top that off with sunscreen but i wanted to show you guys these lashes i mentioned them in my instagram story so instagram stories i'll usually kind of like share random stuff that i find throughout the week just literally random stuff stuff that we're doing little clips here and there but I mentioned these twice and I actually think they're really good lashes. They're from a brand Lash View and they come in like a little cartridge. I think there's 12 clusters for like under $10. And these are the, I think they're sparkle light, something like that. And I didn't think that I would like them, but I really do. I've been wearing them all weekend. And this is, I think I have all 14s in like a 12 minute in a corner. For anybody that follows me for lashes and you're always interested what lashes I'm wearing, cause I will forget, like I'll look at the video and I'm like, I really can't remember cause this was like weeks ago. These are the Sparkle Light um, Lash View ones, so I'll mention that. 
I'll link them down below. And now with the moisturizer, I will put actually put an occlusive sleeping pack on top, believe it or not. I have this one off of Amazon. I bought it based off of a recommendation and I really like it. I use this almost every single night to just really help kind of lock everything in and protect my barrier so that no moisture really escapes when I'm sleeping and I wake up, my skin is not dry, it doesn't feel tight. Um, Cause usually that was like a big issue of mine. This just really has been helping my barrier with that. So my barrier with that, that makes sense, right? Um, and I only usually use this at night, honestly. But because we're going on a very long car ride, I'm gonna be using it in the car. It's like a thick cream, but it's weird because it's almost translucent. It's very interesting, but it is very, very thick. It is supposed to offer um, moisturizing benefits, but I mainly use it to like really just lock everything in and keep the moisture barrier nice and safe so nothing escapes. You know, especially in car rides, the air is constantly like circulating, the same air so dry my skin just kind of like freaks out in those moments so i try to take care of it before i get in the car and then i'll just wash my face when i get home and then i try not to touch my face a lot when i'm in the car just kind of like no makeup nothing just skincare don't touch it call it a day and then i'll top it off with a face oil this is the one that i brought with me it is an anti-pollution god it was like right out there waiting for me to finish taking a shower at all, I was gonna take a shower and I got too lazy um because I want to paint I, I got too lazy I was gonna and I'm like eh whatever I'll take a shower at home this is it has red algae plant stem plant stem cells and it's from the brand earth harbor I love this brand they have so many different great products I don't use this often honestly this is probably like only like my probably my 10th 10th time using it I've had it for some time but I just use it this stuff will make you look like a greased chicken for a five hour car ride, no doubt. Like I used it when we were coming here and my skin was just like this the whole entire time until we got here. So I felt pretty rest assured that the air in the car had nothing on my skin. And then at the same time, it does have benefits. You can use any type of face oil that you want. And that's just one that I had that I was trying out like for the summertime. So I already had that one and I use it rarely, but I do like it for situations like this. Honestly, that is it. The skin is just literally the grease chicken, just how I like it. And it's gonna stay like this literally for the entire ride home. And I just try not to touch my face. My face is not like dried out, it doesn't feel tight. It doesn't, you know, it's just got good, got me some good skin benefits on my skin. And this is just something that I've been liking to do. And then I'll top it off with, um, I'll constantly use the lip balm from Nature. It's like a cute little lip balm. I think it's called a Fido lip balm. And I use that throughout the car ride. Read a Kindle, um, brought my Kindle with me. And honestly, that's that. We just, just kind of what I've been doing. So I thought I would share because I do wanted to have a video up on Wednesday, but I don't have my footage. I actually have a video for these lashes, but I don't have the footage with me because I thought we would be home by now. But since we're not, I thought, let me just pick up my camera and do something like this. So. Honestly, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Just like a short little clip by the way, these nails also from Target. So cute. Oh my gosh, why is it not focus? Maybe I'll do it on my shirt. But it's like a cheetah print and it's like pink with the red. So it's almost like Valentine's Day. I thought it was so cute and I found them at Target for $10. They have like this new brand. I don't remember what the brand was, but they have a new brand. So many cute designs. You can buy it in Target or go in store. And these are glue on nails. And I used the glue that came in the package and this is like day five not a single one is like lifting i don't know what it is but i don't want to jinx it so yeah honestly i hope you guys enjoyed this video thanks for watching stay safe and i'll see you guys in future videos